I doubt it. Oh, come on. Hi everybody, you hear already the music here. Uh, today I'm gonna show you another Commodore 64 game and this is an amazing soccer game. In my opinion, the most fluid and the easiest to play soccer game that was uh, available on the Commodore 64. This game was um, released in 1988 and we are going to check it out immediately. The name is Micro Pro Soccer. Yes. So load star eight one. And you know already now we have learned by the last games and let's see. So when I was in middle school, uh, I, w I, I had a friend in a different town and at some point we were playing also video games and uh, we started um, uh, playing also with the soccer game, but we didn't really like it too much. It was very slow and very, very, very bad. He had some kind of a very old console. Uh, then after many years, I found this game on my Commodore 64. And I played with my other best friend. I told you about him already. That his name is Gipo. And uh, this game, I wished I could have shown to my older friend uh, from the other town because uh, it's uh, amazing. So you have different options here. You can have an international challenge, which is like a one-to-one -one, uh, uh, game, a two-player, one against the other, if you had two joysticks, like uh, the old times, and a World Cup tournament. So we go for the World Cup. I have to select uh, my team, which is going to be uh, player one, and I have to, uh, to, to select which one. It's going to be, in this case, of course, Italy I'm going to take. Then we start a new tournament and this is the first round. Let's see Italy. Where are we? Italy, Italy, where is it? Italy, I'm going to play against Mexico, Austria and Oman. You have to know uh, the various teams have uh, uh, different uh, uh, levels uh, of difficulties. Oman actually is the one that is uh, the easiest one. And uh, uh, the, 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 the best one is Brazil. So let's play some balls. Basically, uh, he's uh, just playing the games for us. And uh, um, there are, you see, typical. Now, it's going to be my turn. I have to warn you already. I am playing with the keyboard. I was used to play with the joystick. So I played in the last few days a bit with this game, but uh, uh, it, I'm not going to be very good because uh, really with the joystick is a completely different story. So, you see, oh, it's raining. Oh, wow. Against Mexico, it's also raining. There is a small trick which I tell you about later with this game. Oh no. No 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 Ah so let's go. Ah Alright I think against Mexico, uh, I'm not uh, good enough uh, with the with the keyboard. I'm gonna probably lose. I tell you, I can tackle that. Okay, at least I didn't catch a second goal. Let's see if I can at least make one. Second. Oh, come on. I told you it's very difficult with the, with the keyboard. It's almost impossible. That's tough. 
So, as I told you, different teams have different uh, levels of difficulties. And uh, we, we managed with my friend, uh, both of us, in fact, uh, to, uh, sorry, where is the keyboard? To, in fact, uh, uh, win the whole tournament several times. So also win against, uh, uh, oui against um, come on ah, against Brazil uh, oh wow okay last one or two zero is not too bad we go on Austria Austria was not so oh it's raining notoriously in Austria look when they tackle you and uh, it's raining it's uh so now italy is ah there we go so i can show you when you are at the here the corner of the area um you basically make goal ev all the way uh, anyway because uh, this is like a trick uh, probably was uh, coded properly uh, really to to achieve this uh, um, this result oh no but what is that <laughs> um, so that you have a chance also to, to win uh, and make goals because the computer of course is, is playing much better than you so one to one let's say that's gonna be tough There we go, see? Basically, the goalkeeper uh, is uh, uh, jumping on the other side, the opposite side where the ball is, if you if you go this way. But, uh, you know, it's not uh, so easy to get there, uh, especially with the, with the tough teams. You know, I mean, uh, if you play with Brazil, it's very difficult to get uh, to their position where you can, in fact, uh, make goal uh, this way. Uh, for easy teams, uh, Ah, oh, but this is crazy. I mean, I, I, I'm so bad. Um, I was very good. The, in this game, uh, we were both very good, me and my friend. And I have to tell you, um, I mean, with Austria, it would have been a 5-0 to zero immediately without even... Uh, I don't even... Can, I cannot even get the ball because... I mean, he would laugh. Gipo, if you are there laugh with me because this is unbelievable you know we were so good ah oh, this would have been a goal three to two instead no so let's say okay but now oh wow he caught it uh, this is i'm surprised Also, it was a bit faster in diagonal, as you see. Oh, come on, man. Where is it? Also, it's a bit difficult to understand which player is going to get the ball. I don't remember how to do that. Come on. The goalkeeper is there. We need to go to the other side. And it's going to be two to two. Well, uh, it's going to be tough. Uh, let's go on. Uh, and the next uh, play is going to be uh, Oman. I hope I, I can at least win against uh, Oman. Ah, uh, come on. Where is it? Oman. Uh, Oman is the is the easiest team. So if I oh come on, if I cannot, I mean, mm 
Oman in principle is uh, like a goal like in four seconds from the start and I, I already could not do it which is uh, yeah okay you can understand uh, what is my level right now um, but anyway so it was and uh, this uh, you one could spend uh, easily uh, the afternoons uh, doing this because oh because you know uh ah. come on italy against oman yes that's the way okay and uh, with brazil is very difficult because they are super fast so some some teams like italy itself uh, spain uh, brazil uh, i think argentina as well they they were uh, very very fast uh, and so it was very difficult to get there but with the joystick it's possible with a keyboard i believe it's impossible i probably will get uh, to the second turn but uh, not much more than that you will see uh. <laughs> you know Oman doesn't even know where the ball is. Okay. So with all respect with Oman for Oman, the real one, because you know, but you know, here in the game it was a. Uh, uh, there we go. Three to zero. Okay. Usually it was like ten to zero in these uh, 20 seconds uh, of game, two minutes uh, but uh, you know never mind so we will see what happens later shall we leave it shall we let it uh, make uh, a point no never mind so this was finished now the first uh, it will uh, go on and let's see uh, end of round one you can check it out and let's see if italy is in yes mexico again versus italy is the first game i'm oh, let's see if we can actually win i doubt it oh come on yeah no no it's uh, uh, i will not uh, anyway i just want to show you i will never uh, be able to to win uh, the championship in these conditions but uh, yeah you see Have a... yeah this was the right side but uh, anyway it was not a problem so i've lost uh, wow so now uh just out of curiosity, let's see all the results of the uh, championship. Who is going to win? Mexico lost against uh, Uruguay. Uh, shame on me. Let's see. Scotland, Uruguay. Scotland, USR, USSR, so Russia against Germany. Germany. And then uh, Scotland versus Germany. Let's see. Ah, okay. <laughs> I was hoping Scotland. But uh, anyway, West well, Germany is uh, world champions uh, 1988. <laughs> Which doesn't exist. Anyway, actually 2021. Uh, okay, I hope you had fun. This is a short movie. And see you next time. Bye. Micro Soccer was the most amazing soccer game in Commodore 64. Have uh, fun with it. 
and uh, play retro games. They are the best ever. Bye bye.